Tomorrow, the El Paso County Commissioner's Court will vote whether or not to improve the El Paso County Hospital District's proposed tax rate and budgets. This budget would include a minimum wage increase to UMC employees as well as upgrading the El Paso Children's Hospital. KTSM 9 News reporter Tani Davis spoke with some of the commissioners about this proposal. And Tani, what are they telling you? Carla, I spoke with Commissioners Ileana Holguin and Sergio Coronado who plan about this proposed tax rate and they believe that this will create a fair environment not just for the UMC employees but those all across the county. Now, according to an article from El Paso Matters, the proposed fiscal year budget for 2024 is about $1.4 billion, an increase of over $18 million over the budget from 2023. About half of the budget covers salary, wages, employee benefits, supplies, and pharmaceuticals. The minimum wage for the UMC employees would increase from $14 to $15. Commissioner Ileana Holguin says these pay increases have been worked on by the county for the past several years to get it to that $15 minimum to retain current employees and draw in new and more qualified ones. That's important because we want our employees um, to be able to have um, a, a living wage, a wage that will support their families. Um, so that's been very important for us, and I'm glad to say that we've been able to do that for these past several years. Commissioner Coronado agrees with Holguin that these raises will allow for the county to retain employees and that they need to keep up with rising inflation. Now we'll have more on KTSM 9 News at 10 on how the commissioners plan on budgeting for these new pay raises. Reporting live from downtown El Paso, Tawny Davis, KTSM 9 News.